Hello, I'm Anaj the Dragon, and you are tuned into another episode of Album Review Art, where I paint the vibes that a album, a new album, is giving me. Do not judge my dirty palette. I don't. I guess that's a good question to ask. Like, do you? Are you supposed to like clean off your palette every time, or not? You know, I'm making up this art stuff by how I feel, and I don't feel like cleaning it off. So, I just keep piling old paint on top of old paint, and yeah, that's just me. Judge accordingly. I don't mind. Anyways, thank you for tuning in to another episode of Album Review Art, where, like I said before, I paint the vibes that an album is giving me a new album, or sometimes just an album I've never painted to. I'm new to this whole painting thing, so you know. I got a lot of albums I could go back and revisit if I really wanted to. And I, I might start doing some um, older s albums. Maybe that I didn't listen to or I haven't listened to in a long time. But anyway, today we're going to be doing The Culture 2 by the one and only Migos. Well, it's not one and only. It's three of them. But you know what I mean. We're going to be <laughs> listening to Migos, Culture 2, The Migos. Is it the Migos or are they Migos? Oh, you know what? You know what? I just learned something new. It says on here, Migos. Not the Migos. But I think I always refer to them as the. Oh, my mind is so blown. I just learned something today. Well, enough of me rambling. Let's get to what you guys tuned in for. Oh, as far as pre-album thoughts, um, I really don't have any. I'm not the biggest biggest fan of the Migos but I'm not like everybody that's like oh my god I hate the Migos like it's like you either have a love hate relationship with the Migos and I'm one of those that's like right in the middle I like the singles um Bad and Bougie I was hooked on Bad and Bougie just like everybody else was um I'm not above that I'm not one of those people that's like I'm so into music and you know that's mumble rap and blah 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 man I feel like every type of expression has its place and was bad and bougie something I listened to every day but no I didn't get left off it do it look like I got left off bad and bougie no obviously I didn't I was with the I was with the craze just like everyone else so you know those are my pre-album thoughts the culture to uh I don't remember the culture I remember listening to it but I don't remember many songs from it so you know Let's see how this album goes. Let's see what makes it to some playlists. Let's see. Let's get this on and pop and go and start. Go and start it. Tell them, tell them, breaking the end of three of my niggas, up in the cell, no 
Bussy, 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 clarity down like nuggets. Pull up on niggas like buggies. Come forward with the legacy dug. Swimming in water like filth. Alright, and I think we've come to an end with this album. I will say around about track. Okay, so I will say I feel like I've come to an end with this album review arc. Here is it. I don't know which direction I'm going to sign my name on. So I don't really know where this is ending just yet. But I kind of feel like when I hang it, I'm going to want to hang it like from a corner of it. Instead of like the correct way, you know, like instead I feel like I want to hang it from a corner. That's the vibe I'm kind of feeling in this painting. Like, I really feel like this is how I want it to look. But anyways, um, the album, my post-album thoughts is, you know, I normally never give any, like, negative opinions on music because I feel like, you know, I kind of can understand the demographic for some albums versus you know like maybe this isn't my cup of tea but i'm also um almost one year old woman and who you know is married and doesn't club and doesn't you know just have a different life so this isn't my demographic is how i look at most music that i kind of look at it like maybe this wasn't for me so no i might not personally like it but I still kind of have like a respect for it. Um, I feel like this album was, I was rocking with it until we got to about like 11, 12, around those amount of tracks. I kind of feel like they gave us too much. Um, and I hardly ever say anything like that. Like music, you can never get too much music. Like what? But I don't know. Like, and that's crazy because I just did an album review of, um, that's still wet, so I'm going to go ahead and put it down. I just did an album review not too long ago of Janae's album, Trip. And it was like, I didn't, each song kind of felt like it needed to be there. But with this album, I, I kind of fell off about track 10, 11. Um, yeah, after that, like the bopping got, I kind of got over the whole bop of the of the album like the album has this they little cadence thing this little bop that they do and it's kind of like after about 10 or so of those the bop was gone in me <laughs> but other than that overall it it inspired what i feel like is really dope art like i really want to hang this like this this is i mean you know this is how i'm gonna hang it because i feel like hanging it from this corner just i don't know it's oh, i like it i like it so you know migos culture 2 and Ozzy dragon album review art mother book <laughs> all right making sure if y'all have an album y'all want me to do an album review art for next. Make sure y'all leave that in the comment section below. If you're not subscribed to this channel, I mean, why haven't you? I'm going to give you a second to do that right now. Second taken. And remember, I love you guys. All right? Later. <laughs>